Hello everyone. In this video, we're going to be evaluating a function at x equals negative 1. So we're given f of x minus f of x equals x and f of 5 is equal to 1. And we're supposed to evaluate f of negative 1. So since f of 5 is given, let's go ahead and start by replacing x with 5. And by the way, this is going to be a quick video. So this gives us f of 5 minus f of 5 equals 5. Now we're given that f of 5 is equal to 1, so we can go ahead and replace f of 5 with 1. That gives us f of 5 minus 1, which is f of 4 equals 5. Great. That's not what we're looking for, but we're going to use it for sure. Now we're looking for f of negative 1, so let's go ahead and since we got f of 4 from here, let's go ahead and replace x with 4 now in the original equation. So remember one more time, f of x minus f of x is given as x. Yeah, let me go ahead and fix this. So here it, ma it makes sense to replace x with 4. Let's go ahead and do that. And that gives us f of 4 minus f of 4 equals 4. Now we do know that f of 4 is equal to 5. So we can go ahead and replace f of 4 with 5. That gives us f of 4 minus 5, which is f of negative 1 equals 4. And that's actually what we're looking for, right? The question was finding f of negative 1, and we did, and the answer is 4. Now, I told you this is going to be a real quick video, so we're almost done. But I just want to raise the question, can we find f of x from this equation? Or at least, there might be more than one solution. Can we find a solution to this functional equation? So that's something to think about. And this brings us to the end of this video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please let me know. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. I'll see you tomorrow with another video. Until then, be safe. Take care. And bye-bye.